Well, as we know, it's a big weekend for the NFL, and while many of us will be watching the playoff game here, a mother and son from Mount Washington now watch, well, at least football, for another reason as well. They say one message that these teams send every year could help save a life, and we tell you about it in today's Medical Edge. For many fans, football is about food, fun, and family time. But just a few months ago, Kelly Bigham found out just what else football can be about. It all started with her son Calvin, who is 12 years old and in the sixth grade. In October, he first started talking about it, and he'd say, you really need to go, Mom. When are you going to make your appointment? And that was really what made me finally call and make the appointment. That appointment was for early detection of breast cancer, which Kelly made after Calvin started saying the same thing to her for several weeks. I said, um, Mom, you should um, go get a mammogram because it seems like it's um, pretty like important to do. Calvin said he pretty much nagged her. A lot. And it was all because he saw what the players were wearing on the field. When they had like the pink socks and stuff, and I thought that it was a big deal, so I thought that she should get it. Calvin said the idea came to him when he was actually watching Monday Night Football. He said he started thinking if these guys are wearing pink, what they are talking about or what they want us to know about might be something really important. That nagging got Kelly in not only for a mammogram, but a second one. And then they called me and said, we actually found something on your mammogram, and we need you to come back in. She then had a biopsy on a suspicious mass. They didn't know at the time if it was cancerous or not. The waiting was the hardest part, like two days of not knowing. Calvin remembers the waiting, too. He spent a lot of time with his two dogs, Farley and Tahoe. He got those dogs through his grandfather, Harry Dates, of the SPCA. I didn't think it was going to be bad, but... You know, I, I didn't really know what was going to happen. Luckily, it turned out to be benign, and after a huge sigh of relief... It really made me think, you know, I need to do this every year. Um, while I was very fortunate, you know, I know so many women that haven't gone and done it, and it was really a wake-up call for me that it needs to be done. Calvin says he's glad he kept nagging and watched football this season for more than the game. I'm just happy that she doesn't have cancer and she's fine and that she actually did it. Kelly says she pretty much feels the same thing. That and, oh yeah, this family, serious football fans now. I was so happy. I mean, you know, it's funny that it took a 12-year-old boy to actually make me call and get the appointment done, but it was kind of when the nagging was a good thing. <laughs> Well said. And Kelly will go now for regular follow-ups, get a mammogram every year.